everyone, it's Pat from Bad Dev Music. Wow, it has been so long. I'm so sorry that I've been away for so long. So as I'm gonna show you in this video, I'm gonna explain why I haven't been making videos, why I stopped making videos. At the end of the video, you'll know exactly what new content is coming up, when it's coming up. I've taken on all your feedback and I'm so excited. So we're gonna dive in right now. Okay, so YouTube, I love it. I love the connections I make with people all around the world. I love getting messages and people saying that they're improving or they want some help. Love that, love that so much. But I stopped making videos. It was just too hard. So here's what's been going on this last year. So here we have a normal week, Monday to Sunday. This is Pat's normal week. So every day begins at about sort of six in the morning and let's say finishes at 11, about 11, 12, one in the morning, okay? So if we've got on Monday, then I would be at school. So I would be teaching and let's say I was teaching. So I'd teach from, realistically, I'd need to get there at about 7.30. So I'd be there from 7.30 and I'd finish at about five, get home at sort of 5.30. I'd literally have dinner and then study and then go to bed or I'd be preparing for the next day. Next day, same thing. Be up at six, breakfast, maybe a run, some exercise, teach all day, finish at five, home at 5.30. Tuesday would sometimes even push a little bit later with meetings so I wouldn't finish till seven. Again, study. Bed. Wednesday. Wednesday I would be at uni. So again, up at six. And this time I'd need to leave my house at about seven in order to get to uni, which was at nine. So I'd be at university, but I'd be at uni again till five. I would get home at about seven. I'd have dinner, I'd study, and then bed at about 11. So this pretty much this entire day is just uni. Done. Exactly the same thing Thursday. So I need to leave the house at seven, go to uni at nine, be home, finish uni about five, be home at about seven, have dinner, study, bed at about 11. So all this is taken up as well. Friday, Friday was not a uni day, which was great, but it was another school day. I would go in for extra days just to help out or I go down at my sister's or my mum's school to help out as well. So there we go. Another entire day of teaching, home by about 5.30, study, <laughs> maybe see friends or family. That was pretty much my Friday night for the entire year. Then we get to Saturday and Sunday. Saturday and Sunday is a little bit different. This time I would actually start work at six in the morning. So I'd start at six, I finished by about 4 p.m. So that entire day was taken up. Same thing on Sunday, so I'd work those two 10 hour shifts. I'd come home, have dinner, see friends and family, study as well, bed by like midnight, one in the morning, get up at four, do it again. Again, all that time. So, as you can see, that's a pretty crazy week. Where's the day off? Where is the, where's the weekend? Oh, there is no weekend. So I literally, this is how it was, and the longest since I went without a day off was 11 weeks. It was insane. I went absolutely crazy, I got really sick with the flu, just because I was doing far too much. So this is the main reason why I haven't been able to create as many videos as I'd like or even have them weekly in the last couple of weeks because I had exams and everything. But this is what's been going on. So really, you know, people at home, you might be thinking, well, Pat, you know, you finish at 11, finish at midnight, you've got a little bit of time over here. I have to sleep. <laughs> I have to sleep at some point. And so not actually getting a weekend or a day off I'd just be exhausted basically all of the time. So as soon as it got to 11, I would be falling asleep. I'd fall asleep on the couch. That happened heaps of times. I'd be actually writing an essay or I'd be reading. That was the other thing. Although it seems like, oh yeah, uni's only nine to five. Uni's nine to five. You'd be doing assignments or you'd be planning in every spare moment. So even though, you know, I'd be planning for lessons Tuesday, I'd actually still be studying for uni on Wednesday, Thursday, Monday night and Tuesday night. And Sunday night, I'd be preparing lessons for the following Monday. It literally did not end. So I'm so excited this is all over. And the next thing that's gonna happen is very exciting. This is going to be my new week, okay? So I will still have work from six to four, both weekends. I will still be teaching two days a week, you know, but more so nine to five. I'll probably get there at about eight. So that's time's gone as well. But look what we're left with. 
three entire days off. I didn't have one day off and now I have three. So there is so much time and I won't be studying here. I won't have to do readings. I won't be doing assignments. There is now so much time to do exactly what I want to do. And what that is, is create. That's literally all I want to do. I've got an album that's almost ready to go. I've got so many video ideas for next year. I'm going to be starting a podcast very, very soon. I'm so excited. All I want to do is create. And for the next several months, hopefully the entire year, it'll be this schedule, three days off a week. That is insane. That's, you know, I haven't had just a proper two days off a week in years, but now I'm going to have three. Man, that's crazy. I'm so excited. Oh, thank you so much for hanging in there. So you've made it to the end of the video. So now you'll know why I wasn't actually posting videos before. Now, in terms of the future, what's really exciting is now every single month, every month, there's gonna be a one finger riff video. So every time you see one, comment below if you want a particular song, I'll add it to the list. But also every month there's gonna be chord videos and advanced bar chord videos as well. And what we're gonna start in December, and I'm so excited, I, I've been holding onto this for so long, is in December we're gonna be starting a video every single day. That's right every day. I'm so pumped. So we're going to be trying a few different things out, but what's going to be really exciting is that every day it's music related. You know, there might be a vlog maybe once or twice a week, but it's going to be music related. And in, in every single video, there's going to be a lesson and we're going to continue this modern musician lesson every week. And like I said before, there's still going to be those one finger riffs, but I'm so excited to, uh, to start this journey with you. It all starts in December, which is a couple weeks away, so I've got a lot of preparation to do. But I'm no longer gonna shoot a whole bunch of videos, you know, like 50 or 100 like I used to do at a time, and then schedule them out. No, on a, every single day I'm gonna make the video, and then on that day it'll come out, so you'll see that video. So I, my teaching, my lessons will evolve, my camera work, my editing, everything will evolve, and you'll see it step by step every single day. That's what I'm really excited about. But I just wanted to thank each and every one of you. Thank you so much for making it to the end of the video. I never in my wildest dreams, have a look at the subscriber count, yeah? That's doubled in the past six, seven months. That's amazing. So welcome aboard to everyone that's just starting here. And I never would have dreamed we'd have this many people, this sort of a connection, this sort of a music family. So if there's anything you want specifically, definitely comment below, but otherwise, so happy to be back and I'll see you all soon.